Hello and welcome to another episode of Pillars of Eternity. This is the Temple of Eothes, the lower level. Okay, full health on all of our, our guys. Did a really quick slave. It's strange looking back. All the time I spent here growing up, never seen what was coming. Yeah, I get. Oh, what's this? A shadow. Let's attack. Hey. Uh, what's this? Dazed. No. I don't like dazed. And attack speed is lower. And accuracy is lower. Can we not hold it? Yep. Hit it. Kill it. Kill the floating ghost. Wow, he's strong. What is it? Curse your eyes! Hi? Oi. Okay, he's done. Wow. Just smack down on our endurance a lot. Okay, let's go through past this vault. I'll take care of it. Well, actually, let's leave the door closed for the moment. And there's another door. So let's, let's let's look in here. A little peek. Um, look that way. Oh, there's another door in there. What could be behind the door? this a phantom how may I help okay right what can you do that helps us Let's... how'd you do this well hey and you try to knock them over Aztec where sun rock Hi. Okay, that was a fail. But this. Arctic where sun rock. Okay, he's what blinded. See this. Kill the phantom. Kill it. Kill it now. Yes. Okay, it's dead. Indeed. I'll take care of it. It is not within our natures to forgive. Those who seek redemption seek a long and winding path, a road which takes us down into the very hollows of our own of our soul and asks us to reflect upon the fractured aspects of ourselves. Interesting. Let's see our guys. So he has plenty of health still. He has more as well. It's fine. Alright. Let's see. There's a shadow there. We'll fight him a bit later. Oh, there's another one there. So we can't kill Hey. Right. You can use this vice per encounter, which is good. Yes. You try not to use these too many times. Hi. Let's have it out. Oh, don't we have another Francis. thing we could give him? Let's see. Oh well. Yes. Uh, run away! Curse your eyes! These are for a walloping! Okay, he's dead. Right, so I think. Anything else here? No, so we're going to. We are not going to go through that door because it's locked and we can't pick it. 
because we don't have four mechanics and five lockpicks or five mechanics. Well, I think we had. Yes, we did. So he has a rod. Oh no, he has a scepter. Crush slash. I think this is better. You have a sword on you. Uh, whatever, man. Whatever. Hold on. So, this is a fine sword. Is it better than his saber? Slash and pierce. He is better. Although, this is something we will need to give back at some point. So. Okay. Save. Oh. No. Take care of it. Okay, we can't go this way. We will need to flush the water. What's in here? A shadow, obviously. These are strong. Hmm? Okay, you need to come in here. Well, you I'm can't because that idiot is in your way. Isn't he? Okay, we need to control this guy. There we go. That piece already up. Wow. Well, how may I help? Well. Leave my mage alone. How may I help? Arise. There we go. And we unlocked 37% of the shadow in our bestiary. Wow, he's down on health again. Of course. Well, that's a stuff to loot. Oh, that, what was on that note? I wanted to read it. Was this the note? No. No, this was the one. A crumpled note. This letter is fairly intact, though the parchment itself has been crumpled. Jester, I know that the temple baths post great health properties and that your back ails, ails you still. Still, I would ask that if you are to indulge your indulge for the greater part of the day you give over your key to the sanctum to someone else for safekeeping this is not the first time we have been forced to wait to perform the day, day's rites and retrix obrika is often too far below to hear our knocking okay so apparently there has to be keys somewhere book prayer book chest, some more stuff, and another book. And some endurance. Mission of minor regeneration. Yep, it gives back endurance. Let's give it to him. And let's put it on his quick items bar. Well? Anything else in here? No. Apparently we need to find a key to this one. So Oh Duh, forgot about this one. Hmm? Okay, so you go and kick his yes. rear end. I guys just kick it. Well ah, curse your eyes! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, he's frightened. Oh. Yes. So you run hmm. away. What is you it? guys go and try to kick his rear end? Yes. 
Rest your eyes. Come on. Miss, miss. Why are we missing the bloody shadow all the time? There we go. Wow. These things just decimate us. I shall. No, no, you shall not go alone. Well, of course. There's another door there. And there's another door there. So let's go in this door. Loot. Okay, that was not a great idea, was it? Did he die? No, he did not. Wow. Okay, how did... How, no, we need to camp. That's the one thing. So, how can I decide which character when I have them all selected? Of course. The one that goes and opens this thing. Minor ring of protection. I think our mage needs that one. Although... Let's go to the mage. If you die on me, bro... I'll be... Yes! Okay, so I guess this is how we do. I know, it's still the mage that moved. Right, how can we do this? That not the mage moves unless well, I select him. Yes. Still the mage moves. Two-handed. Uh, looks much better than the other one. Let's equip it. No, oh, not craft. Improvement. Put it away. Save. Open door, walk in, and die. Oh no, we actually had a look around. This is where we came out, okay. Right, so there was another door here. Right, let's open it. There's one, sh there's, there are two shadows in here. Hey. So what we need to do is knock one over. Yes. Yes. Still need to knock this off. Something sharp. Hi. How about you, blind? Ah, oh. Well. Okay, all of them are dead. Nice. Nice. So let's save before we run into a trap. Course. As you wish. As you wish. Um, I. Of course. Them there. Well. And I'll use you. Open stuff. Just a little blood. It's just a little blood. Trap dot crits Mortarion for 206 pierce damage. Wow. Really? Ok, 
<laughs> of course. He's back there. What is it? What's in here? Oh wow. We were like, yeah, come at me. Okay. Lots of traps. Of Bill, I think. I'll give this to him. What? And before that mob, him more will. Oh, we can't do it in combat, can we? This slot cannot be changed in combat. And obviously, no, you go there and hit him. You go and try to knock the phantom over. Yeah. And you try to run away. Well. Hi. Hope you don't want fire. Hey. Okay, he's dead. It is he dead. He he's dead. Okay. Wow, this new sword. That's quite good. Nah, I can just change it. Well, but that needs to be red. It was a red cape. Okay. Wow. These things hit hard. We can't go in there because we don't have. So this is the only way to go. But we need to camp again. Okay, we are full health, so let's try to do this. Wow, three of them. Three shadows. Let's see, let's see what we can do. Hey. Let's focus on one. Yes. And hope for the best. Okay, Hi. there we go. And now we should be able to catch well. them all. Oh. Hi. Okay guys, come on, do something. What is it? No, it's this one. Hi? Knocked out. Hey. Oh, I haven't used my knockdown ability. Okay, come on, hit it and kill. Oh. There we go. All dead. And he should be back up now. Wow. I'll take care of it. You hear a grinding noise beneath your feet and a rush of water. I guess the water's gone from here now. So that's where we need to go. And just to let you guys know, this is how far I got with with my trying out of the game. So from here on out here on it's completely blind. And let's just enjoy the story and kill this lesser black ooze. There's two of them. Kill it. Kill it quick. So much for you. Okay, there we go, dead. We deadened them. Um, 
Okay, what's this? I guess that's where the key is. Yeah. And... This is where we can go with the gleaming silver key. Okay, let's see what's in there. Come on, come on, come on. Hello? And, well, a shadow is home. Uh, yes. Yes. Hey. You go and knock him over. How may I help? Yep, he's frightened, he's dead. Good. We like that. Of course. Oh, another set of stairs. What could be here? Black ooze, black ooze, that's fine. Let's deal with this one first. How about you stop? You stop doing what you're doing, mate. How about you drop that? There we go. Okay. Nice. The still dark waters are reflective as black glass. Scolders! Kill them all. Anything else? There's something there. Okay, let's kill them. Kill them both. Hey. Hello. How about you knock him over? Is it? And you smack him in the face. How may I help? You do that. Yes. And you do this. <laughs> Oh, stop yes. attacking my man. Huh? Curse your eyes. Hi. Let's have it out. Okay, it's dead. It's now dead. Well, of course. Could this be the pilgrim's last vigil had plus one resolve? Ooh, I'll give it to you, man. Something opened or closed. Oh, look at how good you look. What is it? Okay. This leads up. Let's not go that way. First, there's a passageway down here. So let's explore. Oh. I guess this is the one place that just closed. Because we took the helmet. Damn it. Oh. As you step over the circle of candles, you hear a rattling clunk from the wall nearby. A door slides open with the grinding grasp of stone. Whoops. Huh. 
Right, so that's where we can get out. Can I put the helmet back? I guess we can. Let's try that. Let's try that. Let's put the helmet back and we'll pick it up when we come back. Yes, as you wish. I hear it opening and closing as I click on it. Oh, hold on. Can talk to this. Hmm. Yes. Let's not forget to pick that thing as you wish. Thing up. Okay, let's try this. Let's pick that helmet up again. I hear something opening and closing. What's that? Oh my. Oh, hello. Lost spirit. The light rises from the bones as you approach. You have a moment to register the faintest image of a standing figure. Features a blur of mist or smoke before the world tilts. It is as if you have stepped sideways into a new life. You are racing down a flight of stairs following a weave circle of torchlight. Your own panting breaths are loud in your ears. Panic and your robes alike follow your steps and you nearly stumble before a hand reaches out to grip your arm and steady you. A fellow acolyte who smiles encouragement as you reach the bottom. You run around and pass the shallow reflection pool that marks the lowest point of the temple, following the dark shapes of the older priests as they lead the way towards the narrow hole that leads to the vault. You pass one of the torchbearers as you go. The harsh illumination of the flames reveals a familiar face. For a moment, your awareness spends time and identity, and you think, Virton has joined you, here at the bottom of the temple. In the memory, he glances at you for a moment, and then looks past at someone else. I'll come back once they are gone, he's saying. You are being pressed along by the crowd, and his words are growing faint. Just keep quiet, you can't take any chances. Inside the vault, golden relics gleam like welcoming welcoming stars. The memory twists, jarring you loose from one moment and plunging you into another like a flung doll. There is only darkness around you now. You think yourself blinded until the knowledge settles onto you like a cloak. The candles have all burnt away. You know now, too, with the sick certainty that nobody is coming. There is a cracking noise somewhere to your left, a wet slurping gurgle and a ragged sob. You cannot see and so you cannot know which brother or sister has fallen and which digs after what water a body may provide. You hear in the faint murmuring to your right the familiar cadence of prayer, but you no longer recognize the words. You are too tired to do harm. The thirst is like fire within you. Your tongue is thick in your throat and every breath in a is a struggle that leeches strength from you. There is a light, they said, at the end of every bout of darkness, but this one does not end. The spirit releases you and you come back to yourself in, in pieces. Your vision clears and the world around you is revealed once more, cast in muted hues by the sickly illumination of the soul still drifting like fading fog. Fear wafts off the spirit in waves, fraying at your own emotions. Well, I think this is the best one. I'm sorry, I hope you find some peace in the next life. The spirit seems to be drawing to itself. You sense less of its fear and confusion as it recedes, but the soul lingers still. No matter how many times I see you staring off at nothing, it doesn't get less feared. 
Let's get the remains, see what we can do with it. You spend a few moments gathering up what you can find of the bones of the priests. It proves a heavy and gruesome burden, but you manage to recover them all. Okay. We got all of them. Good. Some of the gold leaf on these relics has chipped away to reveal the wood beneath. There are tooth marks upon one of the bowls. Wow, they try to eat it. This stand rocks unsteadily on its base. It seems that the mechanism is broken. Right. Let's save before we run into some more traps. Some gold. Chest there. Some Adra. And a lot of chest we will be able to open. Oh, nice. Flail. And a pry bar. Interesting. Okay, I guess I guess we found what we needed. So it should be here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Hail and well met. Ah, Virton, this is the guy from the vision that told I'll come back for you. And he never did because he couldn't. He was decimated. Oh. Virgin smiles nervously as you approach. Think I've sorted out the worst of it. Arms hurting a little less. He hesitates. You were down there for a while. Did you find anything? His eyes dart constantly about the ruins. Well, you d he did lie to us, so you lied to me. What? Virgin grins uncertainly. I was clear about everything, the risk involved. Is that what you mean? I did say there, there'd be spiders, uh, and I'll pay you, of course, for the trouble. Haha, <laughs> this one's good. Lift Virgin off his feet. I will crack your head in two if you lie to me again. Burton scrabbles fruitlessly at your arms, his eyes wide with shock. But wait, I don't know what you... He inhales sharply, expression twisting. M maybe I knew where you'd find the bodies, is that it? I'm sorry. Um... Yeah, maybe I should go tell Lord Redrick what you've been accusing his people of. Virton raises a hand, his expression pleading. Wait, wait, no. You can't. They will kill me. Worse, maybe. It's why I needed your help in the first place. You don't understand. I tried to help them. I did. Every day, every single day, I went to their temple and I warned them. I told them that they were playing with fire. And Radic wouldn't be patient forever. And every time they'd shrug it off. Like I didn't know what I was talking about. Like it wasn't costing me coming in to try and help them. I couldn't... I could have been arrested right alongside them. Ah, oh, damn it. We are not smart enough. Okay, so you killed them because you, they wouldn't listen. No, of course not. I... I don't know. Virtum whispers very quietly. I, I think I, I think on it all the time, wondering. I told the commander the priest had left town, and he ordered the temple sealed. I remember that moment. It was like a dream, like I went away for a time. I watched them start bringing the place down, burn the tapestries, the books. It was like between one blink and the next. It was over, too late to say anything. Ada's eyes are wide, disbelie disbelieving. Too late to say anything? You had days to tell someone. I'd have dug them out with my own hands if I'd known. They were some of the last decent folk left in this hole. Now all we got left is people like you.
you worthless bastard, you abandoned them to save your own skin. I told you the way of it. I told you what happened. Guess it's your turn now to make a decision. I don't know how nice we want to be. He is a coward. It's not too late to make amends. Virton, that's the breath he was holding. I'm not sure that's true. It's been years now, what I'm supposed to do. Well, bury the bones. Try to lead a better life than you have so far. Burton looks at the remains. He runs a hand through his hair, letting out another ragged breath. I can do that. I can. I'll lay them to rest. Try and... and do right by them somehow. Thank you, truly, for what you've done. Giving me a second chance. I'll put it to good use. Oh, nice, my positive. Alright, I guess that's it. Temple of Earthes, done. Alright, guys. This is it for this episode. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, then hit that like button below the video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe for more videos like this and all the other videos we are doing on this channel. And subscribing is free, won't cost you anything, and you get notifications when a new video goes up. So catch you later, bye bye.